Welcome to DeFi Crypto Talk, where we talk everything DeFi in the cryptocurrency space. So today we're going to talk about how to win in DeFi. Um, now, for those of us who've been in the cryptocurrency space for a while, um, we've all picked up some tidbits of information and you know had experiences that have allowed us to uh, make it thus far. Um, you know, but there's still some things that pop up each and every day, whether it be a scam or a, you know a new type of rug, um, you know that pops up that uh, you know always keeps us on our toes so these are just some of my things that I've learned that I want to pass along and uh, by the way if any of you guys have experienced anything um, you know in the, in the DeFi space or crypto in general uh, that you think would help others out please share it down below uh, and let's talk about it so everybody can learn so uh, that's pretty much what this channel is about so uh, let's dive into it so um, you know how to win a DeFi space so the first thing when I come into a project uh, or when I'm you know thinking about how to win I want to set a goal so the first thing is you know obviously we're in the DeFi space to make money so how much money do I want to make do I want to make a thousand dollars two thousand a million do I want to retire early something like that so always have a goal set and then uh, once you set that goal you need to figure out how you need to get there now for myself I choose uh, long-term projects when I say long-term I look like you know the drip uh, you know drip faucet here this is a great project to be in also you guys know I'm in the uh, drip garden so I look at long-term projects I'm not saying any of these other ones are not long-term on the animal farm um, but these are some long-term projects um, now if you want to go into more short-term projects like I have one here that I invested in and as you can see 4500 BUSD. I invested this about like two or three months ago and uh, you know the price of the at the time the price was probably about two dollars and then now you can see uh, based off of people just selling the contract no new entrance into the contract everybody's selling and this thing's gonna basically get sold down to zero so um, and actually that entered a little bit after January 28th so um, this was definitely a more of a short-term project it's still paying but I'm getting now pennies on the dollar so um, so next thing you gotta figure out you know what type of projects you want to get to short term or long term um, another thing you need to look into is uh, another thing you need to know is know how to take profits now I'm, I'm bringing this up because I want you guys to learn from some of my mistakes in the past and this is another project that, that I was in that I'm not in anymore um, but I bought down here and I watched the price go up here and as you can see it kept bouncing up and this is all my hopium over here it just keep bouncing up bouncing up bouncing up and then I never took profits which is terrible so always know when to take profits because you know now you don't want to be the last one holding a bag and you know that's what I mean I think I sold down here on this bounce down here um, and then after that it just continues it's just decline and as you can see it's just sort of flatlining now so um, you know another thing know when to take profits so and never be afraid to take profits uh, another thing that I've learned contracts so uh, do your research there's some you don't have to be uh, you know a, a developer you don't have to be in a code um, it definitely helps but uh, there's some things you can look at you know on BSC scan now it may not hold much weight but you know looking for a contract source code verified that's one thing you know checking out uh, the coin itself so contract creator looking what's going on here like I've said in previous videos looking for lock liquidity um, looking for um, you know maybe renounce ownership which they don't have any control of the project anymore things like that so that'll that'll help you out too so that's another uh, thing to look out for and then uh, my favorite is so if they have a telegram group and they have or a Twitter or something like that then get into their telegram group and just talk to uh, developers and just talk to them and you know get all your questions answered a huge red flag uh, is always abound if you ask about a project or you ask about a certain uh, thing you've seen in the code and they end up uh, kicking you out of the group that's normally not a good sign so that's and it's actually good they kicked you out because it's probably a scam so um, you know if you weren't trying to you know cause any FUD but um, most of the times I've seen it in, in, in groups where somebody asks a legitimate question about a code and not trying to you know bring the project down at all and you know this one particular project just happened so happened to be a scam and they kicked him out and said he was fudding the project and the projects you know it's great they're gonna come out with the answers two days later they rugged and uh, that was the end of that so 
Uh, so Telegram is definitely a good place to look as well as you know going back to that BSC scan there. So um, those are just my quick tidbits on you know how to win in the DeFi space and it's just quick quick down and dirty. So uh, let me know what you guys think. Do you guys uh, have any other tips that uh, you can you can pass along so everybody can learn from them. Uh, these are just a couple that I know of. Um, so uh, let me know in the comments. Uh, so please comment, like, subscribe below. I appreciate you guys watching the channel and I will see you on the next one.